Hello YouTube! Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak the iOS 8.4.1 and uh, all this information I'm going to give you can be found at this address taiji8.net and now as you know you cannot install Cydia on a device that hasn't been jailbroken because Apple has not approved the Cydia app but you can, of course, install apps that Apple has approved, like Hotels.com, just uh, as an example. Now, the Taiji 18 has found a clever way to hide Cydia and the jailbreak inside of approved applications. So the result is that you get an approved application that has Cydia and the jailbreak hidden inside of it. And you can then install the, this application and when you start this application, Cydia will be installed in the background. That's why you need to start the application and keep it running for about 30 seconds to give Cydia time to install itself. Now, all you need to do is, from your Safari browser on your iOS device, go to this address, installcydia.mobile. And in this tutorial, I'm going to use my iPhone 4S and uh, first of all as you can see my device has not been jailbroken yet there's no Cydia and as we can see here in settings general about version 8.4.1 build number 12H321 so this is the official final version of iOS 8.4.1 so just start up Safari browser go to install Cydia.mobile Click this icon to get to the free injected apps store. And of course, all of these apps are 100% free. You get apps here and you get games and whatever. All these apps are injected. So you can install any, any app you want. Sometimes Apple patches these apps. So if, if it doesn't work on the first app, then simply try another app. If one app doesn't work the first time, there's no point trying that app again. You just have to move on and try the next app. Usually it works right away, but sometimes you have to try a few different apps before you get it to work. And there we go. Now it is very important that you keep this app running for about 30 seconds so Cydia has time to install itself in the background. Now, you don't have to use the app if you don't want to. You can play around with it if you want to. It doesn't matter. The important thing is that you keep the app running for about 30 seconds. Yeah, just a few more seconds should do it. Uh, you can delete this app once you're jailbroken. You don't need to keep this app. And now when 30 seconds have passed, you simply restart your device. And as soon as you power on your device, or uh, soon after you have rebooted your device, you will see if the jailbreak worked or not. If your phone starts up normally, then the jailbreak has failed and the app has been patched and you need to try and uh, install another app. If it works, then you will see it pretty soon after you have started your device.
Sorry about that. And it's a success. Now the jailbreak just needs to update the system files and then install Cydia. Now it's updating the system files. It shouldn't take too long. And now we should be jailbroken. And yes. There's Cydia. Like I said, all these apps are free and sometimes they get patched. So if the first app doesn't work, just try the next. All the apps are, of course, 100% free. So just download them, keep them running for about 30 seconds and restart your device. Usually it works right away, but sometimes you have to try a couple of apps before it works. As you can see, Cydia is working perfectly on iOS 8.4.1. So there you have it. And if you like this video, please do comment, rate and subscribe and have a great day. Thanks for watching.